Yo, what's up, sexy San Juan Squad? Today we're here doing a ranked 1v1. Happy New Year, everyone. Happy New Year. I hope you're gonna have a great one. I hope you fulfill all your resolutions. And if you didn't make any, let's start some. Well, then I I hope that you do whatever you want this New Year. Um. Oh man, I'm a little bit tired, dude. I had a one of the one of a really good workout today actually uh chest i weighed myself i i'm really happy with with my weight and uh 86ers you guys hear that what is that i don't i don't think i hope you guys can't hear that that's really weird though <laughs> i don't know what that is um, oh, you can absolutely. There's no way you don't hear that, right? Well, you hear it occasionally. It's not too loud, though. Okay. Um, today, we uploaded... I say we because me and Define Pride uploaded um, a montage called Genesis. He did amazing work. Absolutely amazing work in that montage. Um... It's not an easy job to make me look good, and yet this man does it on a regular basis. Fantastic, dude. Well, that's not necessarily what I wanted to happen, but okay. Just split the minions. He literally hit none. That's, that's exactly what I wanted to happen. Literally just push the minions so he hits none of them, and, and basically my life's work is, is complete. I want to see if I can get this red. Which I can. I'm not scared of him. Actually, I probably should be, but I'm not because I'm stinky. He's really low. He only has horrific. Yeah, actually, I'm not scared of him. Let's do his blue. Wait. I'm they should be scared of them. I haven't decided if I'm scared yet. Oh, that is real unlucky. That is real unlucky. The health pot and the the three just comboing up those healing, those health points. But yeah, he uh he got really aggressive there for pretty much no reason. Like he, I mean he has horrific right. Like he can't run away from me unless he horrifics me, and it doesn't speed him up. So it's really hard for him to dodge the Vulcan alt. If you know, if I'm accurate with it, which is a relatively big if because Vulcan ult is at the end of the day it's a Vulcan ult and it's not the easiest thing in the world to hit so but we did hit that one but unfortunately it didn't work out because all of the chalk sustained in the world let's push this in make sure he doesn't get all the all the gold or preferably any of the gold okay I mean I'm Cool with whatever's happening right now. Uh, yeah, no, I'm so cool with it because I have Bancrofts. Like, it might look like he just fucked me up, but like at the end of the day, he didn't, so. Oh, I was really hoping that he would, uh. Damn, again with the 1 HP, huh? Nice. Predicted the back steps. Got the first blood. There we go. We're only 50 gold off of cooldown boots. And I'm actually, believe it or not, I don't know if this is the right play. I'm going to level my turret because I don't think that he's going to focus killing it over me. But, I, you know, I don't know. He has focused killing the turret early or... And like right there, I guess is a good example. 
I'm just gonna get hit by this one, I don't really care. I have Bancroft, so it doesn't matter. It's not like he's gonna be able to kill me. Well, I wish that hit him. Wow. I'm dead. Oh my god, Paul Chan. I think we can actually fight him. What the fuck? He's dead? No way. It's so lucky to live through that, dude. Oh my goodness. What if I just, like, YOLO? Oh. Well. He juked the ult right into me. <laughs> but, it, I mean, it was a good ult juke. I'm not going to take that away from him. That was, that was a heads-up play. That was a good play. Oh, my God. Please back. Type in breast. Get this plate. I should have waited for one more mana. Missing 300 is not good. But I'm not that scared because he's probably going to surrender after I get the next kill anyways. Um, I hope he doesn't steal this. I suck. Damn. Well. Oh well. All I really have to do to win this game, like just because of the matchup at hand and our lead... I don't know what the point of that was. But all because of the matchup at hand and our lead, like, we really don't have to do anything to win the game. We just have to sit here and and play. What's up, dude? What if I just did that? How low is he? Heads up play. Dude. That was such a good play by me. Backfiring in the wrong position to boost myself forward just a tad so I could land the meatball. That's like my favorite play with Vulcan. I love doing that. It's so good. But yeah, I mean, he's going full power and no defense. So this matchup, uh, sadly to say, is just kind of in my favor. But it's all right, because at the same... I'm actually going to get sprint, so when he ults me, I can just run away from him. Talaria boots, really. Uh, so when he ults me, I can just run away from him. I don't need beads. Like, what is it? The three second... This isn't up yet, right? I just want to get the timer on it. The three second uh, silence isn't really going to be that much of a factor in the game. I think. And if it is, then I made a mistake somewhere. Um, I just need to run away from him, honestly, when it happens. What? What? I do no damage, dude. I'm so bad at it. No, I pressed the wrong button. Good luck fighting that turret. That is one tough turret. He killed it. If you think I won't sprint at you under your tower in blind vengeance... Oh, he, you're right. You're way too far back for me to give a shit about you. Um, I can just do Bull Demon, I'm pretty sure. He doesn't have ult. And he's definitely not going to get it back before me, so... As long as we save an ability, you don't get too clapped up. Oh god! Oh, okay, I said don't get too clapped up, and then I got hit by the bull. Smash. 
Uh, we might still be able. You fucking. Got it. He's doing minis. Where is he? There he is. That's what I was talking about with the sprint. I just run away from him and I sprint and then what does he what can he do? Really? Like realistically what can he do? No more tower. Your team has destroyed a middle enemy tower. Okay. No, I try to knock it out of range, dude. You're so stinky. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. Yes. Thank you, Vulcan. When you hit the one, the, re the reason he was dead there, because I know there was minions and the turret was already attacking minions, but the reason he died there is because um, when you're playing Vulcan and you are you hit a god with your one, they get marked and your turret will always focus the marked player over minions or objectives or anything. It will just focus the marked player over anything. I have 3,000 gold, so I'm probably going to leave this fight. So I'm just going to run away until eventually he gives up chasing me. Because if he thinks he's killing me, he's out of his mind. Red's not up yet. I'm going straight into Shard. And then actually, I'm going into, after that, a Divine. I, I don't know if maybe Divine was the smarter play right off the bat, but he doesn't have Bracer or anything yet. Uh, he doesn't have Bracer or anything yet, and the only healing is his 3, and I'm already so far ahead that his healing really isn't of any issue right now. I, sh I mean, technically I shouldn't have walked into that, but also it doesn't really matter. Place that there, it'll give us red buff. If you don't know already, a tier 4 turret can solo a buff if, uh, if you use your 1 on it, and a tier 5 can solo a buff no matter what. So I'll go back and pick up that red now. Thank you. And I guess we just wait for bull up. Bull, bull up? Bull demon to be up. I could be super scummy. You know what? Let's let's play tryhard. Let me show you guys how to win a game when it's a super duper tryhard game. You know you can win the fights really easily, but uh, they're just camping and they're not fighting you. Let me show you what to do to win. It's a lot harder. Okay, well actually he is fighting me. He's not he's not being a pansy, so he is very fast. He just used everything though, I think, to clear that wave. Okay. I'm gonna go do bull demon now. Place the turret out of range of the bull demon so that you're the one that gets aggro so the turret can do damage consistently. It's gonna try to steal this. There we go. We got it. I'm not scared of you, so I'm just gonna run away again. I suck. I'm actually gonna sprint here. Uh, I want my minions to push in. I can brace for this. Once the thing is over. Ah uh, man, I have just, I'm missing everything. Sam the dude, more like stupid plays the dude. Got myself. We gotta keep this one minion alive. Yes, because with this minion alive, we get that debuff on the Phoenix that reduces its protections in half. I don't know why he's not hitting it, but whatever. I guess at least he's reducing the protections. Um, so that we can actually take the Phoenix. We got a wave coming up too. There's no more tower. 
Probably clear the wave. My turret. Stop being so stinky, dude. I don't know, he really can't fight me. Like him, he's just trying to delay the inevitable, I feel like, right now. <laughs> Which is okay, you know. Try everything you gotta do. Are you chasing me? Try everything you gotta do to win. I get this red buff. And then we'll get back. We got so much gold. We'll get our Define now. Define. Divine. And then we're actually gonna go Rod. And the reason we're going Rod is because getting him low isn't the problem like he takes a lot of poke we have that range advantage we can just sit there and throw our abilities nonchalantly because we have fucking almost 40 mp5 so we can just throw everything we want whenever we want and um poke him down the problem isn't poking him the problem is finishing can we finish the kill it, that doesn't bother me at all because if you i mean so he ulted there gonna max range ult Gonna dash to get in range, and then we're just gonna kill this thing so fast. It's it's incredible why he would do that actually. GG. If you guys enjoyed that video, like, comment, subscribe. Remember to check out that montage. It's amazing. Click the bell for notifications on YouTube. And until next time, y'all, peace.